it has been so long oh my gosh i literally i don't even know how to record anymore i forgot how i'm gonna be going to duncan today we have missed a whole bunch of new stuff and it is time i've been so busy working on the business my daytime job and then i work like two other jobs let's put it together we got goals we're trying to make them and subscribe if you want to follow my journey i'm going to be doing more vlog style stuff later on i have finally made up my mind that love youtube absolutely love this platform but editing is basically a whole nother job so maybe in the future i will start taking interns or whatnot but if you're interested in doing that let me know down in the comments below or reach out to my email and we can work something out i know a lot of y'all need those hours for school been there done that we had to do the clinicals for the medical field so finding something is pretty hard yeah let me know down in the comments if you're interested in doing that but we have so much in store i'm so excited for 2024 i told y'all i was still gonna edit the london vlog and also i think washington i still haven't gone around to that and it's been like six months but still in the works but here we are duncan i'm gonna be trying today is the pancake wake up wrap there's a bacon edition bacon egg and cheese and a sausage egg and cheese so we're definitely getting both because you already know we ain't a sweet girl we like the salties and savory so definitely doing this getting both 100 percent the frosty red velvet specialty donut i don't know how i feel about this i always try a donut and i always end up hating it so <sighs> we're gonna try it anyways this one's red velvet. I don't think it's going to be any different than all the other ones that I've tried in the past. So it is what it is. And we're going to get, hmm, the drinks is what's catching me. I don't know. There's so many. A white chocolate ice matcha latte. Okay. That sounds questionable because that's a lot of flavors in matcha. What is this pink? drink looking thing looks like a macchiato but the bottom's pink is that even an option i don't see it on here oh sad day definitely getting hash browns and all right i'm not gonna make you guys sit through me picking all these things because i'm indecisive af so stay tuned keep watching <laughs> We got all the goods, but we're gonna get the hardest one out of the way first because look at this. This is just all crumble sugar on top, I think. It's also glazed. There's white frosting on top. Frosting, icing, white frost, white icing. Oh my goodness. Oh, this makes me nervous. It already smells like, like a whole entire pack of sugar. I already don't like it. All right, we're gonna do the bottom. Maybe this will be better. Probably not. Ooh. I can't do it. <laughs> I really took a bite and I'm like, I can't. You know, it's that feeling that you're sinking your teeth into something you know you don't like. This texture, not it. Yep, nope. I do it. I'm gonna give that to someone because that ain't it. I need something salty already. That's terrible. Hash browns. Savior. Mmm. Every time. So good. Definitely gonna try this. So excited. Pancake wrapped sausage egg and cheese and bacon egg and cheese. This is the bacon egg and cheese one. This actually looks really good and it comes with a little syrup packet so if it's not enough for you and you really want it like breakfasty you got the syrup but we already know i ain't about the sweet so mm. Mm. oh my god the pancake is so soft it's not hard like how you throw it in a microwave from frozen stuff the egg is just egging the cheese is cheesing in the bacon oh. oh yeah i like the wake up wraps but this is just a whole different level Mhm. Mm wow this is delicious if y'all don't like this i don't know what to tell you mm -mm -mm. 
made my hair grow out. My, all my blonde is almost out. Gotta cut it again. Or trim it more so, because a lot of dead ends. Mmm. Oh my gosh, wow. This one's really good. Is that cheddar cheese in there? It's a little orange, but... Is that American cheese? I can't tell. Whatever it is, it's good. Mm, 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 mm. We have so much to do today. I literally just woke up, showered. You know, shower day with the hair washing and everything is a whole thing by itself already. But while I was doing that, threw some clothes in the laundry. Got that all started. So by the time I'm done filming this, I can switch it over to the dryer. Wow, this was like a 10 out of 10. Really hitting the spot. Mm hmm. I just dogged that. We're gonna try some of these drinks. So I got all new ones. I've never had any of these flavors before. The one that I was most curious about, this one is a caramel macchiato. I haven't had a macchiato in a really long time. And I think the only time I ever had one was from Starbucks, like over 10 years ago. But look at her. Isn't she pretty? Ooh. I'm gonna mix it up though. Of course, we have to add almond milk in here because I'm not trying to die. Ooh, this is good. I haven't had a macchiato in a really long time. I did see on the menu, it wasn't on the app, I don't know why, but the, the pink velvet macchiato, that looks really good. The macchiato is good, and the caramel. I wish they put, like, um cold foam on top but of course it's probably extra that one's actually really tasty okay i can't rate it yet because i haven't tried any of the other ones but we have this one this one is a ice matcha latte with a toasted white chocolate swirl or whatever it's called i don't know okay, it's with almond milk again Oh, also, I adjusted and customized every single drink just because what they suggest for normal stuff is way too sweet and it's just not good. So I put two pumps of anything that's sweetened in a medium and one pump of sweetened flavor in the smalls. Did you know that this is like five, almost six dollars because I added almond milk and also it's just expensive. Like everything's super expensive now. It's insane. I think everything that I got today was like almost thirty dollars. Which is insane. This is okay. I feel like I don't really taste the difference between normal matcha and like the toasted white chocolate flavor. It's not bad though. I think I would add a little more something. I don't know what it is. Not more matcha. Because there's already all this. That's the worst part. When they mix up matcha and there's already all these big chunks at the bottom. It ain't made right. Eh, it's okay. Salty break. Mmm. The hash browns are always lifesaver. This one is the toasted white chocolate raspberry iced coffee. Bruh. Ooh, this is good. This one tastes like a Godiva raspberry dark chocolate. With some coffee flavor oh i like this one this is different this tastes like candy i'd like this be different kind of like this one a lot okay <laughs> sausage egg and cheese like look how soft that is Ooh, airy if the cheese is not melty, I don't want it. Mmm. That just flew. This is so good. Even without the syrup. Would anybody put ketchup on this? Or hot sauce? I think I would put hot sauce. Mmm. Screw the donuts. Those are just nasty. 
but these pancake wraps, 11 out of 10. This is not good. I meal prepped wake up wraps. I bought two packs of bacon, baked my own sheet of eggs, whipped it up with some garlic powder, some black pepper. I don't even think I added salt. And then chopped up red and green peppers, a little bit of diced onions, and then put it in the oven to bake. And then I put it together with some cheese, a slice of like pepper jack or Colby jack. I made enough for a month. Kept them frozen whenever I needed it. Just pulled out like five the day before. And that was it. That was like my meal prep for breakfast in the morning. It was a lot cheaper than going to Dunkin' and buy everything. But obviously, you're kind of buying it because people are making it for you. They're providing service. Going out is such a treat. It's so crazy to have to think that way. Our generation has such a different mindset than what it was 10 years ago even. Like, I feel so blessed right now to be in the position of where I am. Just being in the entertainment field and working under people, that was not it. But obviously, the people make it or break it. But I have both positive and negative experiences, but that goes with any job anywhere. So it really depends on how your mindset is and if you're taking it to be able to benefit from it and learn from it. Mmm. I think I like the sausage one better than the bacon one. I'm gonna save this last bite for after coffee. Okay, this is the last drink. This one got me questioning everything. It is a chai hazelnut coffee. Like, I'm so confused. So tea flavored coffee, but also hazelnut flavored. I'm so confused. When they handed it to me, it was like a little green on top and then like it fizzled out. I'm not sure if that's what this beverage was supposed to look like but that's what I got all right here it goes this tastes like a candle guys this one ain't it mm -mm. straight candle oh my god nope zero mm, very interesting flavor very overpowering my mind is really confused because it tastes like cinnamony spice like the the tea spices but also there's co it's coffee it's like someone dumped together tea and coffee i don't know if i like that Ugh. okay this macchiato saving it saving the day mm -hmm. So glad that I saved this last bite because I would have been so upset. My camera battery is dying, so I'll see you guys in my next video. Just stay tuned. I promise more things are coming. Let me know if I should do more YouTube shorts and make sure you comment, like, and subscribe. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!